Hey Capricorn, it's Suzanne with Sunny Forest Tarot here to do your August 16th through the 30th reading. Um, I will get back to the weekly readings in September and I appreciate your patience. Um, I am in between houses right now, so I am up in New England spending some time with a really good friend uh, who I appreciate so much. So, um, so yeah, so let's... Uh, Let's get on with your reading, shall we? All right, so I'm not really asking anything specific this week. I'm just seeing what comes out, all right? So the first row is for the person that you're watching the video for, okay? Whoops. All right, so this row is for the person you're watching the video for. The second row is for you, and I'm using a separate deck. I'm finding that to be extremely helpful and insightful because essentially I am doing two readings, one for you and one for your person and how you guys fit together. So for those of you that are new to my channel, I don't do reversals in general readings. Someday I will tell you why that is, <laughs> but not today. All right, let's see what's going on. Capricorn, we have Page of Pentacles, Page of Cups. Okay. I feel like, oh, geez. So I just heard the word rewind, okay? Um, why am I hearing that? Um, so, okay, so literally, I feel like there's a freshness here that hasn't been here in a while whether it's a new connection that you have with somebody or somebody that has been in your life before. This feels very, very fresh. Page of Pentacles on their end, Page of Cups on your end. I feel like you mutually, you mutually want to reach out to each other. Honestly, this literally could be a case where you you almost both text each other out of nowhere, almost at the same time. You know, Page of Cups could be a little message of, you know, I miss you, or a little bit of an apology. And that's on your end. There's something that you might feel that you know, after time has passed that maybe you could have done differently, you know, whether this person sees it that way or not, okay? But then they also have the Page of Pentacles, which I feel like they're seeing things from, you know, a different, like they're on a different page than they were at some point in the past. Or again, this could be a, a new, somebody new coming into your life. But this feels very new, whatever it is. If it's been something, somebody that, you know, you have, you know, had interaction with in the past, had a connection with in the past, and it kind of went stale, it, it feels like, it feels like a fresh loaf of bread, is what it feels like, it, it does. It feels like just, uh, you know, there's a new opportunity here, okay? Yeah, what I just say, they're looking at things from a different perspective. The hangman, that's what the hangman does, okay? You know, 
He can't see things in the right way when he's standing up, so he has to hang by a tree <laughs> to see everything the way he needs to, okay? Um, so I feel like this person has had, you know, either a change of heart, a change of perspective, um, and is seeing things differently. And you, Capricorn, this is you, Queen of Pentacles, I feel like the shift for you is if you weren't completely in your authentic self in the past, now you are, okay? And if you were in your authentic self in the past, I feel like this person is now understanding what that meant. When you were being authentic in the past, this person might have questioned it, but now they are seeing things from a different perspective. Six of Pentacles. And look at that. You have the hangman as well. You are seeing things from a different perspective too. It's like this. there needed to be this period of time that needed to go by in order for you to be completely authentic with them and, and for them to be completely authentic with you. You are now understanding perhaps why they couldn't give to this situation the way you wanted them to in the past, okay? And they are understanding that you might have been completely authentic in the past with them and they might have questioned it, but now they're looking over the situation and seeing things that they didn't see in the past. The devil, well, there you are, <laughs> okay? Capricorn is on this person's mind, okay? Eight of Wands, communication. So I feel like, I, I do, I feel like there is a draw to come together and talk with these two cards, these two cards here, um, you know, after finding new perspective for both of you, this person, I feel like this person sees you more clearly now where they just, there was something that they didn't understand in the past. You have a strong desire to talk to this person. May, you may be the one that reaches out first. They have the five of swords and you have, you have the devil, seriously? I mean, devil, devil, hangman, hangman. New perspective about Capricorn is the main message here, okay? Very clear. Five of Swords is somebody that is, um, you know, this can be a fight or somebody that wants to fight for you, fight for this connection. The fact that this card is sitting in between both devil cards tells me they want to fight for you. That's beautiful. And quite amazing, actually. <laughs> I mean, kind of incredible. All right, so I want to see, I want some clarification here. There's quite a bit to clarify here. And I'm using a third deck to clarify, okay? And I'm gonna do the clarification here in a little bit of a different way. All right, so I'm gonna clear, I'm gonna use one card to clarify both pages, okay? Because I feel like this is a mutual energy between the two of you. I'm gonna use um, one card to clarify both hangman energies because I feel again this is a shared energy between the two of you 
And then I'm going to clarify both devil cards because this is a shared energy between the two of you, which is amazing. All right, so clarifying the Page of Pentacles and the Page of Cups, we have the freaking hangman again. So the hangman showed up three times in this reading, which tells me that the message that you guys want to exchange with each other is about a new perspective that you both have about this connection. So to clarify the hanged man here, we have the Ace of Pentacles. It's about wanting a new beginning with each other, starting over. What did I say right from the start? This feels very new. You both have a new perspective on coming together as a new beginning. Devil card clarification. Knight of Cups. Okay, you both want to move forward and express romantic love towards each other. Oh my gosh. Can you believe it? That's amazing. Wow. Whew. All right, so we're going to look at the Crystal Angel cards for both of you here. One for them, one for you. And then Romance Angels. One for them, one for you. card they got, unconventional, unconventionality. Your unique qualities are an important part of your life purpose. It's okay to feel and be different from others. Okay, so there's an unconventional, I can't say that word very well, unconventionality uh, about this person, possibly about this connection or how they feel about this connection. It's unconventional, okay? For you, you have busy times and multitasking, taking charge of your schedule during this busy time and honestly assess your underlying reasons for being busy. All right, that kind of speaks for itself. I don't think that this card specifically relates completely to this reading, but you may see that it does. It might be that you're coming out of your busy bodiness and you've had time to reflect okay on a new perspective they got reconciliation this whole reading has been about some type of reconciliation or something new someone from your past is returning to your life all right you can't make it up you got very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you so right now it's really important you know and you you both feel very much on the same page as to what you're thinking and wanting for sure as you saw in this reading um so make sure you keep your thoughts positive you know if you know you had put this connection to rest it feels like it has the potential to resurface Okay, it definitely does. So we have very soon reconciliation. I don't know, that's, that's pretty, pretty telling if you ask me. So Capricorn, very interesting reading this time. Um, and I will be back in September with weekly readings again. I appreciate your patience once again, and I will talk to you then. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.